Hello ladies, I just thought I'd check in today because I haven't checked in yet and it's really cold and dark and wintry today and I'm feeling cold and dark and wintry. I'm in a look that I put on whenever I don't know what to wear. You know your classic look, but it's got a few adaptations. So I'm wearing my really old J. Crew trousers in wool. They were called Campbell the make and they never made such a good trouser since. I think the quality of J. Crew went down a bit, but they're such a good fabric and they don't itch. You know how wool trousers can itch. I'm wearing my old Celine um, top, which I love. I wore it on Sunday and I had to wear it again today. And then it is a polo neck, but I decided not to do the polo neck look and I've got a Saint Laurent scarf on. But my buy of the year is this, this. I, I saw in, who was it? Sally Hughes. Uh, put something on her Instagram, hello everybody, about French, a French woman saying the way you are cool and sexy at 50 and it was don't have reading glasses and don't do this and don't do that and I thought Bleh. but um, I'm always losing my glasses and so this little thing I got from Zara for £15, little leather pochette, um, I put my phone into my glasses when I'm going around the office because the the second most commonly asked question I have to all the lovely people who work with me is, where are my glasses and where's my phone? So how many of you identify with that just thingness that we do at a certain time in our life? Um, I wanted to come in here actually and get some nurturing cream. And then I was a spying because I had in, in the taxi last week, I had lots of lovely ladies who are professionals in beauty and they all brought out different things. But somebody brought out all these products which I've had in my bathroom and I haven't been looking at properly by Eversence, not Eversence, um, Elixir, like this. And they brought out the blue one which they loved. And so I thought actually I would try it. Firm Conviction, Lifting, Contouring and Shaping Serum. I usually don't really like serums like this. I haven't got any makeup on yet, so I'm gonna try it on. Lifting, Firming and Shaping Serum. How can a serum shape your face? That's what I'm interested in. I don't know what's in it, but I don't know if any of you have tried it. It somehow appeared in my bath, which means somebody sent it to me. Um, it's not something I bought, which means um, it's very low on the list for me to try. Um, but I like to, hmm. Nice smell. What's that smell? I know that smell. I don't know. I don't know. How are you, Liz? How many of you done your Christmas shopping yet? Black Friday was quite a magnificent time for us. Um, many of you um, came and, and bought. And we're just doing, ah, oh, three days till you get Miracle Blur. So you can pre-order now. Very exciting. And, um, and then on Wednesday we go live with them. I'll tell you properly all about it then, but I feel there's this anticipation to it. Um, just put that product on. It did this thing, and I suppose if something is lifting and toning, then it's sticky. You know, it just doesn't leave that smoothness on your face. I feel, uh, 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 uh. So I'm gonna put on top of it, actually. I'm gonna lose the light in about five minutes. I'll do my makeup quickly. Uh, I'm gonna do Crema F. Crema F, I went this weekend to, um, Santa Maria Novella, which is the wonderful pharmacy in, um, in uh, Florence. And they have a shop here in Walton Street and they have the most beautiful, oh, this is so good, the cream, av avocado cream. It's the most nurturing winter cream ever. It's one of my favorite, like if you want an old fashioned cold cream, but it has so much avocado in it. There we are, Crema F. I'm nearly at the end of it there. Um, they're not that cheap, lovely glass jars, but, but the quality of the product, it's that kind of, some, some guys, we don't want a facial oil, we don't want a serum, we just want something that gives us vibration, smell, texture. Yes, I'm feeling better now. Oh. So, um, Shabir was here yesterday and we were talking about lymphatic drainage. That's going to be on the blog today if you'd like to listen to it. Um, a really interesting conversation. I learned a lot and there's still a lot more to learn. But every time I see Shabir, I really learn things about our system. I'm going to do a look today. Is there any particular look you would like me to do before, before the light totally disappears? I am thinking of a swainy lip today. Um, but that would require me to use 
I, I, I'm going to be doing this in the dark, aren't I? I just sense I am. Um, my God, it's so dark. I can't see anything. I can't see products. I can't see if I have anything here that I want to use. Got some sunlight. I think I might, what am I gonna do? What would you like me to do that you could even see? I don't know. Have I tried Naum treatment candle? I have, it's beautiful. Uh, Deborah, every time I wear your BFF, people tell me how glowing I'm look. It's, that is the purpose of it, but it's so nice to hear it. Um, you went to the original store in Florence last week. I was in heaven. It's the, it's like a, te it's a cathedral. Santa Maria Novella, if you don't know it, it is a cathedral. If you ever go to Florence, ladies, you have to go. It's the most beautiful place, beautiful old fashioned creams, incredible potpourri. I got it for, I'm opening my cupboards at the moment thinking, oh, there's shoes there. Is, a bit, is it a bit smelly? Not really, because I'm an anal hygienist, but I, I was missing the smell of my potpourri from, from Santa Maria Novella because it's that sort of bitter medicinal, wakes you up kind of smell. Uh, I'm gonna do a bit of BFF first. Let me just put that on. I can just about read light medium. And I'm thinking about Christmas presents. I don't know if you are. I think I might just do a Christmas present haul of, of things that I'm giving people. I'm going to not spend so much money this year. My sister and I were thinking we'd do Secret Santa, but it's sort of not working out that way. So I'm gonna give little gifts to the girls in the office. And I'm then going to, so I'll probably try and find something that will suit lots of people. And then I need to give gifts to all the girls I work with on this morning. And then I, just people I work with, I need to give gifts to. And then I need obviously Lila, who. How many of you have a teenage child who says, Mommy, I haven't sent you my Christmas list yet. How quickly they go from Father Christmas list to Mummy or Mummy and Daddy Christmas list. And I just, I thought, should I just get a one present this year? How would she deal with that? If I just said, Lila, you're having one present this year. I'm just, you know, I'm, temp I'm very tempted. She might be watching this in her maths lesson going, are you kidding? Anyway, but it, it's something. I don't know how you will feel about that pressure as a parent um, of what you're gonna give your child. But I think, now the ring. Okay, let's talk about the ring. I've just been attempting to stick down the ring with jungle glue. You need to know the rings are exquisite. You need to know that you've got to know your ring size really well. We won't be doing returns on them. It's kind of like it suits you, it's yours or not. It's not cheap, it's gonna be like 125 pounds. It's the cost of the ring, which is like 107 pounds plus a lip glow. I think I'll only do them in lip glows or lip balms. Are there any people watching who think they would love the ring? And if they don't know what the ring is, ask me. But what color would they, I think you'd want it in lip glows because you want something that you most use and find accessible. So, so that's what it would be for me. Um, done my BFF, now I'm going to do, um, I might just do, I might just do a bit of Sasha today. I don't know what I feel like. No, I'm going to do some Chloe, actually. With navy blue, I love to do Chloe. So if I can find it, I'll do it. If I can't find it, I won't. Might do a little bit of... Sh you know what? Do you ever use Schmuggy as a blusher? This is a blusher, which I've sort of fallen in love with again. And it's just a might be in your match to me, but it's a really fresh colour. And I was going to also try it on my lip today. That's what I was going to do. A little bit there. Rub it in. Just want to see how it is on the lip. Blushes you shouldn't put on the lip. They're far too powdery. But if you have Anna, you can put it on top. And Sonia was telling you last week that they use Catherine on their lip. So... I thought, I wonder how this will look. There, and then I'm going to put Anna on top. Let me just see if I even have Anna here. I am, apologize, I'm talking to myself. Um, have I got an Anna? Jesus, I've got to refill and restock the bathroom. Anyway, can we talk about Christmas? Because I need some good ideas for Christmas. So I can tell you, that, you ladies some good ideas for Christmas. Um, I've got no bloody Anna, have I? So irritating that I don't have Anna here. <sighs> no, I haven't. So instead, I'm going to use Miracle Blur. Yeah. To just diffuse. 
and then I'm going to use a strong note. There we go. And then I'm going to do very light here, just to diffuse that area. And then I'm going to do for them my pause there. There, and then I might need to put some just a touch because if I'm going to do a strong lip, I need to tone down my cheeks with some um, Trintron. If I got it, if I got it there, I got it. Thank God for that. I've got a brush. Let's see how to I'll just do it with a huge brush. Why not? Just to quickly tone that down. I have got some very nice things on Trinity London as gifts called duos and trios, which we've really carefully curated. And what we've done is we've taken colours that suit the majority of people, very common colours that people order, and we've put them together as stacks. So it's a great way, and they come in the most divine gift box. So I know that quite a few people will be getting those. I don't mind giving my own things for Christmas because I sort of feel... I'd want them to. Okay, doing that there. So, Trintron on, and it's going to be a bright lip. Is there a particular bright lip you would like me to put on today? I'm, I'm really rambling today. I'm just, I'm, I'm yes. I saw the Xmas shopping today, few Black Friday deals still on. I visited myself, I tested myself to wisdom. It came the next day after Black Friday superb service. Well, that's fantastic. Good, it's lovely wisdom. Have you tried Neem? I've got that one. Will you be putting the vitamins talk up? I will. I will put it up. Um, we're editing it now, but it should be on the blog quite soon with all of the uh, information. Zara Line sold out of those navy puffer coats. It wasn't even on sale. I blame you. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. Um, uh, I miss you. Oh, okay. um, the live yesterday is fantastic. Thank you so much. I know I learned so much from Shabir. It's fantastic. Um, I will do the vitamins one, don't worry, I will do it. Is BFF suitable for teenage skins? Definitely, Lila used it, she's 15. Do you think you need an eye base with your eye colours? No, I don't think you do. If you have really, really oily eyes, you might want to, but generally not. Christmas presents we will do. Um, you have a teenage like that. Uh, nice to know, darling. Um, Deborah's always started Christmas shopping, love gifting, need to check out products in Trinidad, they're very good giftings. And also the bag, all these things. I'm gonna have a room of everything to show you for gifting because um, how one present never works. And smoky eye pale lip would be nice. Smoky eye pale lip, I can do that. I can do that. Let me see the office, but I can do that. Buy the small, medium, incense scents and the elements. We have a big present in a small one, which is usually new pajamas, that's it. That's nice. Have you got your hair layered? I'm going to the vid. I don't. Um, I, I really, it's sort of all one length and it's was for a bit shorter here and longer here, but I don't, I'm not somebody who's into layering. Even down here, there's, it used to be shorter, but now it's all the same length. Um, yes, you would love the ring with a balm. Good to know. Please put yesterday's vision as I will. We're not giving any gifts for anyone under 15. It's all about the food and the company. That's very nice. Try Katinka. I hope she's watching. My mum tried that once. I'm now 29, still getting presents. <laughs> presents then ring. What are, what's a ring? What's your favourite perfume? Probably there's too many, um, but I love citrusy smells. You always use Chloe with navy. I love that. Think a lip glow would be but fabulous on its own or over other lip colours, especially as it works and they don't like makeup a lot on their own. I think lip glow too. Dahlia with navy, that's a very good choice. I'm not sure about my match to me colours. Is it Brown Thomas that you have your stand? No, we don't in Ireland, my darling, but go on to Trini Tribe and look at the ladies there because I think it's very helpful and you should find something that could suit you. Um, uh, I've just joined, I've pre-ordered Miracle Blur and I've got the ring on my exercise list too when it's a big ring, baby. I'm, I, I hope soon. I'm just testing it today. We literally are making it by hand here. Um, the Miracle Blur looks like some magic filler. It is, it's fantastic. Trini, can you tell us about the brush you're using? That's a Fourier, um, that's a um, Artiste brush. Very nice for just blending, 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 blending. It works really well. What makeup color tints should I use if makeup goes orange on me? Um, I would say use light me medium on our BFF. You're, re you're reusing your eyeshadow bag for traveling, fantastic. Your 20 minutes should be yesterday was very good. Thank you, thank you, darling. Um, I was happy to do it too. What was that brush that, so I answered that one. Um, how does a blur work for you? <laughs> it works for me really well. I just put it on my lip lines and 
rub it in and it just blurs all my lip lines, my acne scarring, everything, it's phenomenal. Presence for Lila, I had this rhyme, something you'd like, something you'd need, something to wear, something to read. It's very sweet, that. Danke vielmals. Thanks for life, should be a, a whole stack, so excited to give it to her. Great. Valentina, yes. Have I heard of Neogenesis stem cell skincare? I don't. I'll see what they are. I love things that Annette follows. Um, oh, darling. Yoli Fortish skincare. We can all have days where we just feel a bit flat. You know, this morning I was feeling a bit flat. We had a very good weekend. Every, it's like there was no reason to feel flat, but I was just a bit flat. And then it's a question of getting that energy, feeling what's the worst bloody thing that can happen today. That's one thing I sometimes say to myself when I'm feeling lacking in energy and getting up, moving around and even, okay, I'm gonna ask you to do this now, Yoli. Um, get up now if you're sitting watching me and do this. flowing around you. Do it again. And you'll feel your body, the sluggishness, the flatness. The endorphins will kick in. That's sometimes what you need, those endorphins. Feel them rushing around your body. Just try and imagine it. If it isn't physically feeling, I'm just feeling out of breath. But sometimes physically, we need to change what we're doing if we're sitting a long time. And mentally, that will then help that mental change too. But these are important things. I'm gonna do a very quick makeup now. I'm really out of breath. It just shows me how much I need to do. I need to do more, um, more cardio and less smoking. Uh, use Frintron and Mattifying Balm for the first time today. So quick to use, couldn't believe it. You're a rest fresher. Thank you, Quirk Patricia, that's lovely. Um, what's your favorite candles? Victoria Cater phenomenal candles and they're beautiful the smell is good they're less than diptyque and they're stunning victoria cater um my top is old celine um hello from spain um very st Edmunds. that would be lovely wouldn't it trini thank you i'm good we got to just feel good about ourselves. You bought the gold blaze from Zara, very 1980s, fits superbly. Debra, fantastic. I gave that to Claire. It's her 30th birthday and I bought it for myself and then she loved it and I thought, wow, just do it. I would wear chariot with that gold blazer and a pale lip. That sounds beautiful. Um, darling, you're, you know, just go for it, my darling. You'll wake up tomorrow, it will feel better. Or it really just, just think. Life is okay. Life is okay. Um... Okay, I'm gonna now very quickly do a makeup look. All right, so, so, all right, I'm gonna do. One of you said, one of you said smoky side, so I'm gonna go with that first. Um, and I'm just going to do one of the new colors. Actually, what I might do is, if I have it here, I might do face and mystery. Oh, and I've got it. All right, let's just do this. Let's see, because face is one I haven't used much, but it's a kind of dirty brown. I'm just gonna do a little bit right by my lash line. I'm gonna do smoky, smoky actually. So I'm gonna do there. Now I haven't got my glasses to help me. And the light is really shit. So I apologize in advance if this all goes belly up. So I'm doing one finger right by my lash line here. Smoky, 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 like that. And then here, I'm just doing it right by my lash line. And then I'm just gonna take my Clean a finger and do that. So I'm making it very smoky there. All right, then I'm going to take a little brush. Oh, I've got a nice little brush here from Ray Morris. If you want to do little brushes, the best brushes. And I just bought them actually today. They're the tiniest good little brushes. So I'm just going to do my little lash line below. I'm going to do quite a smoky eye. I'm just going to go for it. So I'm going to just go underneath here. And let's go see here. Okay, now I'm gonna go under here. So this might look like a very severe line. I'm starting with this, but let's see what it leads into, okay? This is my quick look. It seems all odd right now, but I'm going to really blur it out. Then I'm gonna take, still looks very hard, doesn't look like somebody who needs to do new makeup because they've done it 
that same dark circle for the long time. But when I find ladies who I might come across who have done this look for a long time, I then try and, I'm just trying to find the right brush. I then try and smudge it all together. So I'm taking a little bit here of mystery, going back and forth to smudge it all out there. So I still want to have that smoky eyed look there. And then I'm just going to go underneath with that and really fuzz it out. Fuzz, that's Charlotte's word. I love that word. Fuzz it out there. I'm fuzzing, ladies, fuzzing. So no hard lines, okay? Fuzzing, fuzzing. And then here, just going, just going around and around and around, gently. I mean, without my glass on, this looks quite good, but you could all see me much better and it might just be looking a disaster, but I think that's sort of, and then I'll just fuzz a bit more. Really fuzzing. This is like a sort of look of a very bad pixie woo moment, I think. There we go. Like that. Well, certainly my eyes look bigger, but they might look a bit messy close up. And I'm just then softening that with Ray Morris's divine brushes. This is the one time I will use brushes. So, okay. <laughs> um, just then go under. I'm not going too far down um, because I don't want things too low because I've got a slightly overhanging. Then I'm going to get, it's about to run out of light, ladies. Then I'm just going to get my Talika. Put that on there, like that. So I've got faith and mystery on together, there. And then I'm going to put, I just want a little bit of a very, like a very neutral shade of something. So let's see what I've got here. I if I've got anything neutrally, hang on. Phoebe's not right. I think I want to do, I might do Taya actually with something, if I can find it. I, I can't find anything now. Hold on, lip gloss. Wrong box. Um, Sue's, no, not Sue's. Okay, I'm going to do Tashi, I'm going to do Lila and that. That's what I would love to do if I have it here. Yes, I've got it here. Yeah, I'm gonna do Lila. Lila and Eugenie there. Because Eugenie on me can be quite blue, but it's still a nice neutral, like that. But then if I put a little bit of Lila on top, it makes it that very nice nude that's not too pale for me. There. And then I'll take the last little bit, make it a tiny bit of blusher. And it's a mixture now of Eugenie and Lila. Like that. And then I'll take that nice big brush and I'll just blend it all a bit in. And then I'll go underneath here and blend that a bit. There. Smoky eye. I'm not gonna to go too close to see how badly it's done. But I hope that whoever requests a smoky eye, that's smoky eye in faith and um, mystery. But it's nice, it's sort of soft. You saw how hard it was at the beginning. That's how many of us can do our makeup with that hard black line and just soften, 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 soften because it's opened up my eyes, they look bigger. It's not too bad, even with my glasses on. All right, ladies, have a good evening. It was just nice to connect with you because I, I felt I hadn't checked in today, but the light is literally disappearing now. And um, we'll check in again tomorrow. And this week I am at Phoenix in Bond Street on... Okay, one second. Alice, what day am I Phoenix in Bond Street? Fenwick and Bond Street, you are Wednesday and Brent Cross on Thursday. Fenwick, Bond Street, Wednesday at 12 o'clock, I'm doing Trinity Time. Yeah. And Thursday and in Bond yeah. Street at 11 o'clock, I'm doing Trinity Time. Are there any appointments left? Yeah, there's still booking appointments available. for the masterclass. There's tickets for them Okay, there's a few tickets left for the masterclass. Wednesday, Brent Cross, Thursday, Bond Street. Oh, and okay. that's at, sorry, Wednesday, <laughs> Wednesday Bond Street, Bond Street Thursday, Thursday, Brent Cross. And they're at six o'clock? Yes. Six o'clock. 
Um, and you can still book uh, classes as well, uh, you know, one-to-one -one appointments. Online, Trini London, you can book everything. Anyway, ladies, have a good evening. Mm. Bye.